your starting center fielder for the National League All-Stars in tomorrow night's All-Star game in Miami. He is Charlie Blackman. How you doing, Charlie? Hey, Rich. Thanks for having me. Oh, come on now, man. I loved meeting you in person, and you had, you had the dinosaur shirt on, and you came in, you hung out. And I always appreciate that, so thanks, brother. Yeah. So thanks. what what's going through your mind right now? Charlie? Oh, uh, you know, I got a lot going on. We're, I'm on the bus right now. I actually headed over to Marlins Park. Okay. Um, Who's on so it? We, you just, Give like, me the scene. All of the National League. Like, I've got, like, batting camp sitting next to me, Silver Slugger sitting next to me. Uh, I mean, it's just, oh, like, if this bus goes down, Major League Baseball will be no more. <laughs> that's, that's, that's what we got on the bus right okay. now. Okay. Now, uh, Charlie, yeah. very important here. When you all go back to the hotel, is it a same seat policy? Uh, you know, it's pretty loose and relaxed here. You, you sure? Kind of get it, yeah, you can do whatever you want. Is yeah. is Harper driving the bus? No, no, we we got professionals for that kind of thing. Okay. I, I don't. <laughs> yeah. Where where is Bryce Harper on that bus right now, Charlie? Uh, you know, uh, look around. Talk I know. He must be in the back where it's all the cool kids. I don't see him. No. Okay. All right. Well, so you're all just – now, does anybody break out in song? No. Like you know, it's uh, a lot of a lot of small talk. You know, like, hey, I know you from playing against you, but I don't know you that well. So let's okay. talk about, like, you know, the weather. Mm, really? That yeah. is so disappointing. I got to be honest with you, Charlie. A little bit sad. Yeah, I know. So now that's why you got on the phone with me because we're 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 old friends going back at least two weeks, you know. Yeah, we'll talk about something better than weather. That's for sure. <laughs> okay, let's do this uh, tonight. What is your approach in hitting a a baseball intending to hit a home run, Charlie? <laughs> I've never done this before. I'm not gonna lie. Um, you know, I, honestly, I, I'm just shooting for one. Like my goal is one home run. Okay. Uh, and if I hit one, I'll just be happy and then just, you know, I'll just have a good time with the who's, rest of the, the derby. Who's, and, uh, who's throwing to you? I've got Darren Holmes, our bullpen coach, is going to be throwing to me. And he throws BP to me every day. So uh, I'll feel a little more comfortable, I guess. You mean Darren Holmes, the former major league pitcher? Darren Holmes? Oh, yeah. Yeah. Yeah, that's him. He'll Eric, be there. Eric, I'm going to turn to my Rich Eisen show researcher right now, Eric Zurendorf for El Zorro. Look up how many career home runs Darren Holmes gave up. Would you mind doing that? And then we'll, does he does he serve up the gopher balls, Charlie? To you? Yeah, he's got a real good flat four seamer. Just comes in there real nice. Okay, itching to get crushed. Yeah. <laughs> now, have you had any? Is there any? You know, uh, is there any sort of I guess wager that you have with your teammates is how far you're going to last? Anything going on off to the side we should know about here? No, you know, I don't. <laughs> I don't think there's a lot of people putting their money on me, you know. So uh, I don't think anybody was willing to throw out a, an odds line for that mm -hmm. for the derby tonight. So we'll just kind of have to see how it goes. Okay. And what about going up against? Who are you going up against in the uh, in the first round here, Charlie? Uh, Bellinger. Oh the my Dodgers. gosh, yeah. Charlie! His dad's throwing to him. I mean, it's such a warm and fuzzy story you're going to have to go up against here. Yeah, but you know, don't worry, don't worry. I, I'll have it. I'll have it figured out by then. Yeah. Don't worry. <laughs> okay. Well, and you and G Cody Bellinger are the slightest contestants. Are you aware of that? You're, you're just a mere two. It's felt two fifteen, and Bellinger's two ten. That's like half of an Aaron Judge. I know. I mean, these guys outweigh us by a hundred pounds. It's, it's a little bit ridiculous. Now, if you're two fifteen, how much are you if you shaved your beard? How much would you weigh with if you shaved your beard? Yeah, sure. like two hundred. Probably. Really? Like if you shaved your head and your beard. Would you lay? Would you weigh less than two hundred pounds, Charlie? No, no, I, I, I'm, I'm a little beefier than that. <laughs> <laughs> oh gosh! So, uh, how, how, uh, how, how was that yesterday? Watching, uh, watching a no-no uh, potentially get get twirled in front of you with Kyle Freeland yesterday. I was r ridiculously nervous. Um, you're going through every possible scenario like later in the game as to like what could happen and how you like, like if the ball gets in the sun, like I'm, I'm at least trying to like take it off the chest so that I get an error instead of getting a hit. Like it, I mean, it, it's more nerve wracking. I felt like for me than it was for 
for the the other team trying to get the hit, I guess. Now, what is it like in the uh, in the dugout? Because I know you know the the uh, the history of baseball is you can't talk about it. You don't you don't even make body language about it. What was it like in the dugout as it was uh, you unfolding? Kinda, it's kind of like business as usual. Like nobody talks to you know nobody talks to Kyle. You just leave him alone. Um, you don't want to break his concentration. So outside of that, it was just a normal baseball game. So then answer me this then, Charlie Blackman. What, what was the worst small talk in the dugout during a potential no-hitter with your own teammates or what's going on on that bus with your new National League All-Star teammates? Uh, what do we got? Uh oh, we're, uh, I'm, we've got a lot of complaining about the travel right now. What do you mean? Like, uh, you know, like we came from the West, you know, a couple hours, time difference. So you lose a couple hours coming east, and then you had to wake up, and you know it's just it's it's a lot of excuse making. Right. I'm pretty good at that though, right. so <laughs> like I can do that with the best. So stuff. right now, like, is Bellinger bitching about the the travel? Is that what you're saying, or Kershaw, or what's happening? No, no, I think Kershaw threw like a two hour game yesterday so that he could get here. <laughs> That's right. Yeah, oh, man, that's funny. Yeah, he did, man. They're they're lights out right now. The Dodgers appear to be. Yeah, they're hot. They're hot. Charlie. They're team. All right. Yeah. So is this? Uh, talk to me about this because every kid dreams of being an all star. You know, I mean, that's that's childhood dream stuff, Charlie. I mean, what is this? What is this like for you, being an all star? Uh, it's it's honestly it's a whirlwind. It, it's cool and it's a lot of fun and it's a great experience for your family. But it, I feel like someone hit the buzzer on the weekend. And then it's like nonstop, go, go, go. And then it's like over before you know it and you're exhausted. Mm -hmm. So it's, it's just a whirlwind experience. So who's really. part of the Blackman Posse? Who, who do you got there? Uh, I've got my family. You know, my immediate family's here. Um, got my girlfriend here. It's just a, uh, you know, a small group. Uh, but it's nice because, you know, we've got so many teammates too. So yeah. Uh, Everybody feels comfortable. Yeah. So what's your what's your so what is the pre home run derby last couple for you here, Charlie Black Blackman of the Rockies before he participates against America's sweetheart um, Cody Bellinger tonight in the first round of the home run derby, and and again Charlie, you know, good luck absolutely destroying that feel good story <laughs> on behalf of all of American baseball fans yeah, and, yeah. and lovers yeah, of father no son problem. relationships everywhere, Charlie. And that's no no big deal. Um, so what is your what is your pre home run derby routine? Are you going to eat something? Or are you going to have dinner? What do you got, Charlie? What do you got for me? You know, I'm just I'm going to save all my bullets, not take any batting practice beforehand, okay. and just kind of roll it out there and hope for the best. Okay. Okay. How's that plan? Is I that like plan? it. Just take it one pitch at a time. So do, do we know how many how many home runs has Darren Holmes given up in his career? Shout it out. Sixty three home runs he's given up in his career. Can you hit sixty three home runs? Tonight, no if, <laughs> if you list, if you last the okay. whole derby, no, 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 no that's okay. too many swings. Okay, uh, uh, and so now, can you do this for me, Charlie? For for this, for me, and for the fans of this show. Uh, at one point, if you don't, if you don't like one of Darren Holmes's pitches, just pull on. Just when you take a pitch, pull on your beard. That's a way of saying hello to me and the entire Rich Eisen show audience. Can you do that? All right. I'll, I'll 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 see if I can remember that. You no know, promise. I don't want you to do it after a home run because we're going to watch the ball in flight. I want to be able to see you on camera. If you just take a pitch, just think about tugging the beard just for us. Okay. All right. Would you mind doing that? I'll, I'll see what I can do. Okay. See well, enjoy the enjoy the experience, and thanks for holding up that mug. I saw you took a picture of it, the Rich Eisen show. Yeah, mug. yeah. I'm, it's, it's in the mail. I, I want to see it on your desk, like so everybody can see. Like, well, no, I want you to center. keep the mug though. Charlie? No, no, no. I'm keeping your mug that you gave me, but I'm sending you that ridiculous oh, water I, bottle thing. I didn't know that. What is that? So we just noticed you were holding something. We had no idea what you yeah, were yeah. holding. What is yeah, that? That's coming your way. It, it's 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 one of the nicest water bottles they have in the team store, if not the nicest one. A Colorado so. Rockies water bottle. Right. And so I will be drinking out of that uh, from this from my show desk. I'm all, I'm all in, Charlie. You know that. Yeah. Yeah. So it, it's on. It's in route. Okay. Good luck tonight and tomorrow. Awesome. Thanks. Thanks, Rich. Always. That's Charlie Blackman. Rocky Center Field. The Rich Eisen Show. Weekdays at noon Eastern on radio stations across the country and audience. If you like that video, be sure to download our app. Don't have any memory on your phone? Let's start to delete some of those slow-mo videos you have. And you know which ones I'm talking about.